Next up, we got YB in the mirror. Let's get it, nigga. Yeah. Bay on flex, X testing. Yeah. Brand new Rory, Smith and Wesson. You know. So look, bro. I seen a video, about a 10 second clip. My squad was hitting me, and when I say the squad goes, hey, 420 EP is dropping, nigga. 420 meaning April 20th, the stuck of the 90s EP is dropping. Yeah, we finna do a little promo right now. I told y'all I finna go ahead, nigga. Why is it called stuck of the 90s, ghost? Because it ain't finna sound like that little turned up shit you hear today. Yeah, look, when you hear this, ain't none of that little Uzi. That, uh, well, YB here in the mirror, he kind of sound like a West Coast. But, uh, yeah, that famous Dex, anything you thinking about turning up to, you finna pop a molly, do the, uh, Block Boy JB, that ain't finna happen, bro. This EP right here finna take you straight back to 1996, straight to 1992. If you don't wanna hear that type of rap, then don't listen to it. But we got too much of that turn shit right now for me to go ahead and drop an EP like that. I'm not finna do it, nigga. Stuck in the 90s, 420. Back to YB in the mirror. I don't know where they at, and I really don't care. When they hit me with this video, bro, I seen a little bit of it, and I said, look, they was like, it's real, bro. Oh, yeah, I do know where they at. They was at Rolling Loud. And I guess Lil Wop, Gucci Man artist, I ain't never, look, I ain't never even heard no music from this nigga. I'm being 100 with y'all. But y'all know when something, look, if something break, we finna cover it. That's what we do. That's just what the f we do. Why be in the mirror up in the trailer? Lil Wop and his squad pulled up. And we got the video. Let's see what's up, man. Okay, okay, okay. That's the part I, let me take that back. That's the part I seen. When I'm socked the window and I stopped it real quick. I done see him bust the home up. Let's take it. Back. If they was inside that trailer right there, bro, let me tell you this. If you inside that trailer, you talking all this little, you had the little thing with TK. You had the little thing with your people up in your own city when they made that little diss video. Everybody tried to get me to react to it, but I don't do it because I don't do it. Look, we don't do cloud chasers. That's the only reason I don't do it in the mirror. But when you woofing like that, bro, when somebody at your trailer telling you to come out, you have to come out. I don't care if you was by yourself or whatever. He would have gave you that fact. There's too many cameras out there. I don't even know what issue y'all had. But that makes it, we finna watch it again. That makes it look bad on your behalf, my nigga. <laughs> what y'all want to do? He all up in a trailer, bro. That little nigga getting hit. Oh, that's all okay, now, this is YBN Almighty J and Namir Response. Let's see what they have to say. Y'all apologize every time y'all niggas say something. Y'all apologize. Every okay, yeah. every, time, every, 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 every nigga. Every nigga. That don't matter. Look, bro. They can get into it with a hundred rappers right now and apologize to all hundred rappers, but that's not true. Hey, I hate when people look. If somehow between somebody else, you can't be like, "What about when you did that to? What you about? Nah, this is your situation and your issue, bro." You got to handle this like a man. He was up in your trailer. So if he apologized to everybody, and he bitched up to everybody else, and now he making you look like a bitch, what that makes you? You know, you can't bring up other situations, bro. That's not how we rocking. Y'all young, yeah, but it don't matter. You in the grown man's game now. You know what I'm saying? You can't be, like I said, spitting all that game banging, yes. You up in a rap game, YBN, period. They all considered as gangster rappers. So y'all gotta go ahead. All oh, that younger, why little why do that? It don't matter, bro. You consider gangster rappers, and you are of age. Why be in Almighty J? His best. How, how many rappers she done fuck? You know what I'm saying? That y'all in the mix. He know what he doing. He know what he doing. And WAP know what they doing. Y'all can't. Y'all can't bring up this other bullshit, bro. Every nigga, every nigga, every nigga that don't apologize. 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 Every nigga that don't ap
niggas would not have no bro be for real my nigga on my mama both feels really up with these niggas bro wouldn't be none of these internet hey, watch. you can't look bro you can't be and it wouldn't be none of this internet talk internet talk it's not no internet talk this started in the street at your trailer bro you were supposed to be outside. Yeah, this and that. I catch this fake, this and that. Don't nobody respect this. You can't have this cracking up in your trailer to have to run back to your phone when you're up in your hotel room with the homies. Now y'all feeling all safe and that type shit. That's not cool. Niggas not get down like that and they don't respect it. Every beef y'all have. Every beef y'all have. Y'all don't settle with it in the streets. Y'all settle it on the phone. And it don't get settled on the phone because don't none of them get squashed. It just blow over. It's not squash, it's just blow over. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got no beef with Tay K, this and that, but everybody know y'all feel some type of way on both ends. Tay K and you. So, yes, it's still there if y'all was to happen to see each other or if y'all squads happen to run into it. It's still there, bro. You can't talk about no internet, nothing when you was face to face with the nigga. Now you running, you the one that's doing the internet right now. Because I ain't seen Wop say shit yet. His actions spoke. That's it, nigga. Why they internet talking at these blogs, nigga? Fuck this nigga talking about bro broke that window, okay nigga, you broke a window. I ain't broke shit, bro. What? And I don't never get on I don't never get on this internet shit about that shit, bro. But now it's up for real on Jesus Christ, nigga. Fuck this nigga talking. Whoa. <laughs> that was up for real, bro. Namir. Jay, I don't fuck with that nigga straight up. I keep it 100, but you know I rock with you. Young, you up in the game or whatever the case. But you be like, yeah, you broke a window. Yeah, you broke a window. If you didn't address him right then and there. He broke the window to try to get at you, bro. Y'all was sitting up in the trailer like that was y'all baby daddy outside. I'm being 100 with you. Like, y'all was just scared of spook for y'all motherfucking life. The nigga was beating on the spook wolf this wolf. Let me see that last part you said. What, what else you said? Because y'all niggas was up in there spook. Yeah, you broke a window. Yeah. yeah. What else? You, what you want to do? Shoot the motherfucker up? He was trying to get in there. That nigga was hungry. He was trying to eat. Man. Come on, window. I ain't broke shit, bro. What? And I don't never get on. I don't never get on this internet shit about that shit, bro. But now it's up for real on Jesus Christ. He didn't touch nothing because you didn't give him nothing to touch. You were supposed to address him. You'll never be on the internet. Y'all always get on the internet with it, bro. I remember the last little video thing you had when you was with Tay K. You was like, uh, what'd you say? Are you just like, man, I slap cuz. That's exactly what you said, nigga. I slapped the fuck out of cuz. I remember that, nigga. That was internet talk. And Tay K locked up. He can't get at you or address it or respond right there and there like you can. Lil Wop wanted to get with you, bro. I wouldn't. You shouldn't address this on the internet. Like I keep telling y'all, bro. Y'all big homies need to step in on this shit. Because y'all getting money, but still y'all dumbing it down and playing it down to where y'all not going to be around in two years. And I'm not talking about life-wise. I'm talking about music-wise. Like, people ain't going to respect the music enough to where they're not going to respect y'all no more. And about two years down the line, they're going to, you know what I'm saying? Because it's too much blemish. You can't keep getting into beef after beef after beef after beef and never get one resolve. Never catch one fade. Or never just, you know what I'm saying, squash it with one person in their face, nigga. Y'all never do it. So, it's looking awful. It's, y'all, you watering down your image, nigga. I'm being 100 with you. It's getting watered down like a motherfucker. You got to switch it up. I want to see you win. I do. But this right here, this that young shit, that bullshit, you got to remember, you getting money, you in the grown man's game, nigga. And grown man, they don't play them games. For real. Grown man's game don't mean we out here playing sports for real. Grown man's game, nigga. You move lightly, you move strategically, and you move smart. That's it. You keep your head up, your chest out, get your money, and stay on the low, nigga. Low key niggas always win. It's them loud motherfuckers that get kicked out of, you know what I'm saying? We don't want them around, nigga, at all. You gotta start addressing these situations, man, and stop. And stop with the internet. I'm out of here, man, 100. Yeah. Bayo Flex, extensive. Yeah. Yeah. Brand new Rory, Smith and Wesson, you. Yeah.